Following immigration raids and rumors of immigration raids, Baltimore's religious leaders are demanding answers. They say city parishioners are, are living in fear and deserve clarity from immigration and customs agents. WJZ is live at City Hall. Devin Bartolotta with more on the rally held this morning. Devin? Just that rally was here this morning at City Hall, and they took their message right to the front doors of Homeland Security. It's the fear of that knock on the door. The deportation rumors in Baltimore more terrifying by the day. There's a lot of rumors about who's going to be picked up, when they're going to be picked up, that ICE agents following immigrant people. Just two weeks ago, 28 people in Baltimore were arrested during a four day immigration crackdown by ICE. We want to know where our people are and what's happening to them and to make sure that they get the resources, especially the legal resources they need. Now more than 50 religious leaders and activists are seeking answers. Clarity, compassion, and no confusion. And marching for a meeting with ICE. Enough is enough. Meet with us so that we can sit down and on this thing out and do the right thing. Taking their concerns right to the offices of agents in charge. And after sending three letters, the group hopes showing up straight to the door of Homeland Security will get their questions answered. Mike Mugo, a Kenyan immigrant, knows the uncertain feeling. We're living in fear. In fear because even if you're illegal, you know, you don't walk around with your papers stamped on your face. And every time somebody hears that accent, they think, oh, here's another illegal person. Groups standing up for Baltimore's undocumented immigrants, not knowing who ICE will come for next. While this group did not have their answer, their questions answered today, they vow they will come back. WJZ contacted ICE for comment, but have not heard back. I'm Devin Bartolotta reporting live for WJZ. Devin, thanks. Today's march was led by three Baltimore area organizations working together for immigrant rights.